guys and girls, and thank you for watching another episode of the Xbox Tester. My name is Maurice. Today, we're gonna play Deathloop on Xbox Series S. I was really curious how this game would run on the Series S, and it doesn't disappoint. So, without further ado, let's go check it out. First of all, let's see how much data this game is on your SSD. And that's 36.5 GB. The game is on Game Pass. So if you have a Game Pass Ultimate or a standard Xbox Game Pass subscription, you can download this game right away and play all you want. The game is fully optimized for the new generation of consoles. Xbox Gen 9, Xbox Gen Scarlet. So yeah, let's go start it up. You guys. If you like this kind of content, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. It means a lot for me. You're really helping out the channel. I, you can also, by the way, hit the bell icon. I upload almost on a daily basis. New games, old games, updates on games, and even a little bit of hardware here and there. Ah, it was a little bit of a stutter. So now you guys also know that I use Elgato hardware <laughs> to record these videos. But yeah, Deathloop. Pretty awesome to see this game finally come to the next gen Xbox consoles. It's, uh, it's really, really cool. And this game looks gorgeous. So it was a timed exclusive for PlayStation. Uh, they had like a deal with Bethesda just before ah, Xbox bought Bethesda Game it? Studios. But uh, okay. they still um, made it work for PlayStation to keep it. Yeah. On PlayStation for a whole year. And the year is gone. And now we have it on Xbox consoles. Yeah. In day one. For, uh, for us on PlayStation, uh, on Xbox. So uh, I already did a video on um, on uh, on my PlayStation channel about this game. And um, yeah, you're really curious, but Maurice, how does it run? Well, maybe you've already seen it. It runs. Um, it has two graphical modes. So. The visuals. We've got a performance mode with dynamic 1080p with scaling, performance prioritized, no ray tracing, and a steady 60 FPS. Yeah, that's what we need. And there's a visual quality, dynamic 1080p scaling, graphics really high, no ray tracing, but 60 FPS with drops. So that's visual quality is the way I would go if I have like a TV or monitor with VRR, a variable refresh rate. Um, I, I did play it on a not compatible uh, monitor without VRR. And I must say it's still pretty playable on visual quality. I had a few drops in the, yeah, in the 55s. So it's between... 55 up to 60. Yeah, there are some drops here and there, but the game looks really good at uh, the visual quality mode. And performance is also really well. So right now I'm playing on um, visual quality. And yeah, it, it, it already is really stable. So this time... I'm already a little bit into the game. You gotta be kidding me. Five, seven, three, right. three. That's something we need to remember. Let the... But look at these graphics. Those You're are beautiful. Really awesome game. But you're also, of course, really interested oh, in the performance mode one. and will really so 573357 exit now let's wait until we're outside what's this 
Good weapon trinket. Why would someone put this? Whoa! What the? What the? Oh my! Wow! Wow! Okay. What is this book? <laughs> ah, it's cold and weird. <sighs> Reprise. Okay. Here you go. Okay. Here it goes. Daybreak. See you. Now oh, let's load a little bit. Let's see how far. Ah, that's pretty fast. You survived. Knowledge discovered. Gear discovered. Okay, continue. Welcome to Deathloop. Yeah, 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 sure. Let's see. Let's pick some trinkets. And then, and then, and then. Steering healed. And that's 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 good. Trinket? No, oh, I've got no trinkets. Shock absorber and explore up down. Up dumb. Death loop. Pretty cool game. But very hard. Dorsey Square, second floor. Dorsey Square, second floor. Look at these Dorsey graphics, Square. these light effects. Those are pretty insane. How do you know where I am? You got cameras all over some... tower tracks your position, and you always act so surprised. Here we go. I don't even know where I'm going. Uh, wow. Sounds like you're angling for an invite. Loop. So you can show off your now let's go to um, options and visuals. Visual mode. Performance. I'm gonna do camera motion blur off. So got a little color stuff. Why settings? Yeah. Different me. This so this is performance Don't mode. Ah, this way, is sharp. You can say what you want, but this is this is some sharp you. graphics. I personally, by the way, think to really consider the rumble effects of this game are insane on your Xbox controller. They almost feel like uh, the, 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 the haptic uh, controls of the... Or the dual sense controls of the PlayStation. It's that good. And I'm not even exaggerating. These are some of the best rumble functions I've ever had in a Xbox game. No, let's see if I kill you. What happens? And stay down. Good. Oh man, this game is so gorgeous. Does it nag me to get up in the morning and I don't know, close the toilet seat? Some future this is this And you can choose your own way how you walk through this game. I think that's so cool. Stealth is gone. Let's shoot a little bit. Awesome gameplay. Shooting feels so good. Look at the light effects, by the way. It, d it doesn't even have ray tracing, and it still looks... It almost looks like it had ray tracing. How insane is this game? 
gorgeous. Can I get up here? I can. That's better. Gorgeous game. dies but yeah you guys this is death loop running on xbox series s and if you have a game pass subscription go for it it's a really awesome game go check it out it's out right now have a lot of fun i really want to thank you for watching and i hope to see you guys soon in another video bye